Welcome to Good Mythical More. Here we are hanging out, talking about Reddit threads. How many followers certain Reddit threads have? Let's see if we can guess. We're gonna quiz each other. But first, we're going to donate $1,000 to Women in Film to aid in their mission to advocate for and advance the careers of women working in the screen industries in front of and behind the camera to achieve parity and transform culture. Please join us in giving at womeninfilm.org. Right. Thank you for being All your right. mythical old man. So, by way of reference, Link, I question, I mean, do, do you think it's a good idea to draw attention to the Good Mythical Morning subreddit? Or is that a, you frequent it. I'm neutral. Okay, just by way of I reference. I think we gain just as much as we lose. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm hot. There are, I'm a little hot. 90, just over 96,000 members of the Good Mythical Morning subreddit. Good show. Um, so if we... So just to with, kind of put things into perspective. With, uh, with 4,000 more, we could break 100,000. Um, what about the Rhett and Link one, though? Uh, that's less. That's, an, that's different. That's less. It's like. different. Let's look. Uh, about 46,000. Okay, that's all right. That's good. So a little less that's than good. half. Oh, there's an ear biscuits one too. There's an ear biscuits. Thirty-seven hundred. Okay, that's lower. That's all right. That's all right. Keep it. Keep, join, join the conversation over there. It's uh, it's we we have nothing to do with it, and we never read it. Would would you like to go first? Uh, yes. The name of this subreddit is Chairs Underwater. Colon. Self-explanatory? Chairs underwater. Oh, self-explanatory is, uh, is the your writers added that. Your explanation? Meaning, is it, is unnecessary? it's just called chairs underwater. The context for that link is it's just chairs underwater. This is specific. Why I'm does this interested. even exist? I'm sort of interested. I mean, well, you know when, when, Bring, when I go it up. scuba diving. See chairs? I haven't been to any wreckages, but I really want to go to a wreckage. Oh, I have. And it's like to ease into wreckage, you kind of just want to see a chair first, I think, just to know if you can take it. So it's like, it's kind of like scuba wreckage training. And so there's probably a lot of people like that on this thread, at least tens of tens. You know what I once did, Link, while scuba diving? You I, took a chair with you? I went to. In case you got tired? A ship with Shepard. And there, uh, it was a ship where they had added a big steering wheel, whatever they call that on a ship. They had added that so that you could go and get a picture of yourself driving the ship in your scuba gear. Like it wasn't originally there, it had, or it had fallen off. Huh. And it spins. Didn't get a picture, but I did it. That's pretty cool. Um, chairs underwater. I think some people will really be off put by this, especially this if it's like a, a recliner. I need to have my polarized lenses. I on. mean, yeah. See, that, that chair is subtly underwater. Isn't yeah, it? you can barely see it. So that's a, that's taken from outside I mean, of the water. Anybody can join over any period of time. I am going to guess. Uh, I think there's 999 people following this. Oh, there's a there's another chair in a swamp. Um, okay, Link. You're so wrong. How many did you say? 999 people? Yeah. 155,000. <laughs> What's the appeal? Um, read the, read the, okay. A Re community dedicated to appreciating the beauty of chairs underwater. The beauty of chairs underwater. But there's a friendly reminder, if the chair in your post is not fully below the surface of the water, please mark your post. Yeah. NSFW. Yeah, look, look at all not, of these. NSFW stands for not submerged fully in water. Yeah, because look, look, they're all NSFW, and so they're blurry until you click on them. Ha! <laughs> as if it was like a picture of something naughty. Oh, that's beautiful. That is cool. Oh, that is, that's the best. I'm joining. This is a great thing to follow I'm joining. during celibacy. Week. Joined! Because it makes you very unhorny. Actually, I was thinking uh, the don't, don't do that. It's my turn. I'm moving it away. Oh, good. You move that away. <laughs> you cheap host. That's me. Chairs underwater. I like their sense of humor. Yeah, that's fine. I might join. I did. It's. I did. Are you sure it's not chair sunderwater? 
Reddit thread, bread stapled to trees. <laughs> Exactly what it sounds like. Bread stapled to trees. Now, I'll tell you a couple of things about this. Number one, um, this is no chairs underwater, okay? Because chairs underwater, based on the few pictures that I saw, there were chairs that people found underwater. But bread stapled to trees is just asking for people who are making the post to be the one who stapled the bread to the tree. And I would venture to say that a rule, if I was in charge of bread stapled to trees, would be like, you cannot rule, there's one rule. There's one rule in bread stapled to trees, and that is you cannot be the person who stapled the bread to the tree if you are doing the post, okay? But I don't know if you guys have principles. I don't know you. And I think this is so confusing when you think about it because a bread I'm stapled to a tree and I am confused. is not gonna last long. It's not like a chair underwater. Is it some sort of bait? Squirrel bait? Or is it some sort of bait? Uh, Link, there's no more than 9,000 people in this. 8,500 to be specific. Well, as we speak, there's six people online <laughs> in this thread. Oh, six people online, okay. Including me. Um, yep, I've double checked this answer and it is correct. There are 329,000 members of bread stapled to tree. <laughs> and if you'll look here, there's whole wheat on a pecan tree. Okay. Or a pecan tree. Link, can you read about this and see if I was right about the principles? Uh, pictures of bread stapled to trees, pin posts, there are sub rules. Please read them before doing the thing. If you cannot read, get someone to read this for you. Yeah, let's read it because I'm thinking about it. One, you newly submitted post must gain bread, must contain bread. You, they, they got a typo in the first yeah, yeah, they're worrying about bread. Said bread must be stapled. Said staple must affix said bread to a tree. Many things are bread. Please read the acceptable bread list below for what constitutes bread. <laughs> Most things are not staples. Figure this one out by yourself. If you cannot, then this sub is not for you. Number six, apply rule number five again, but substitute the word trees in place of the word staples. <laughs> Seven, no cacti, no young trees, no bonsai trees. Of course. Mods get all pissy when they see this. Yeah, yeah, you can't. Seriously. Bonsai, you can kill a bonsai with a Eight, bread. no more than three pieces of bread on any single tree. <laughs> We don't, want a bread we don't want a bread covered tree. Mm -mm. Number nine, do not use more staples than are required to affix your bread to the tree. Seriously. So there we go, this is basically. They have a lot of principles, but they don't have the principle that I think is the most important. But maybe if they had. Well, the, what they just said, because your principle is you can't be the one who stapled it. Right. Well, this just says, do not use more staples than are required. So it's implying that they're doing this themselves, oh, which right. I don't like. But it, I agree with you. But it is the reason there's so many people in it. Mm -hmm. Because if you can They're only find the bread stapled to a tree, mm -hmm. we're talking really low numbers. But now, because it's a participatory thing, yeah, I don't love that. Now we're, we're now now I understand why there's people. Who, now I don't agree with you. I'm not joining. I'm not almost not going to read the other fifteen, but Rules? I am. Yeah, but I am. Oh, there's fifteen more. Do not endanger your body to get an awesome pic. Pics look less awesome viewed from a hospital bed. No virtual posts, Minecraft art, AI, etc. Of course. Uh, no memes, no repost. Don't be a crust face. A crust face is what we like to call people who act like an ass hat. <laughs> okay. Uh, actually, I'm not gonna read any more of these because I'm not joining. AI is really gonna screw this thread up. I'm not joining this. Hey guys, this is Matt, this is Matt. What's up, Matt? True or false, there's a subreddit called Trees Stapled to Bread. Yes, there is. Yeah, gotta because, be, gotta be. because there's 300,000 people who are smart ass enough to decide to do this. It's true. Right, how many people Four, are in that? 4.4 4, thousand. Right, yeah, yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Nobody it's not cares. as good. Nobody cares. Bread stapled to tree, not cool. Okay. Fingernail collectors. Ooh, okay. Uh, what do you do with your fingernails when you chop them? Um, at work or at home? Both, in that order. Well, it's different. It, at work, I um, I cut my fingernails over the trash can, but it everything oh, misses. They pop. 
pop yeah. left, right, up, They down. miss, and I just uh, I just leave them there, the along dogs. with the hair that I cut. For the dogs. Well, no, here at work. Here at work, I just throw it on the floor. Sorry. Are you joking with me right now? I did it this morning. There's Your fingernails are on the floor yeah. in that room? and my hair. I cut some hairs. And you just expect people to come in and just vacuum it up? Yeah. I mean, they're gonna vacuum anyway. That's quite an, an expensive host we've got there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. At home, I, uh, I do it over the sink and I send them down the drain. Ooh, bad form, bad form. I don't need your judgment. Ah, bad form. I didn't ask for your input. Okay, well, I'm gonna give it to you. It, uh, it's an organic material, it can go down the drain. I think it should go down the toilet. <laughs> it's a yeah, different but, pipe. Yeah, but you gotta help put your hand basically in the toilet to cut it. No, no, you do it over the sink. And yeah. Then you gather and drop in the toilet. You gather and you drop? gather, yeah. Mm, okay. How many people are in the fingernail collectors? I think a lot are in this one. I'm gonna go with um, 422,000 people. Nine. <laughs> Nine people? <laughs> what? Yeah, this is, this is a, so you, unpredictable. You, this was you wouldn't think that this was the case, would you? Uh, read this. Uh, this is called collecting container. This is a post. Uh, Hi, I just wanted to know where do you guys store the nails? Do you have some container or do you collect them in separated boxes for each finger? <laughs> Why? But that would be your question. I am new to this hobby, so maybe someone with more experience can help me a bit. Thank you. <laughs> okay, the other eight people. Didn't weigh in. All right, let me let me ask you one. Um, Reddit thread long Furbies. Members post pictures of long Furbies. This is there a species of Furby that's long? Not that I've heard of. Or is this like a Furby that's been stretched? I don't know. We know that it's real, so we're gonna get to see something. It's just a question: how many people are in it? So, long Furbies. Long Furbies. What part of the Furby is long? The whole thing? Because Furby is kind of, the thing that sort of makes a Furby a Furby is the fact that it's not long. They're kind of squat. I want to know if this is a, is a it, modding community or if this is a collecting community because those are two different things. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Are these modders or are they collectors? I think they're modders. I don't think this is an officially sanctioned It's Furby. harder to be a modder because it's easier to collect things than it is to do things. Would you like the answer? Uh, yes. These are modders. Okay. Uh, nothing against people who collect things, but collecting something is not doing anything. Yes, it is. It's finding. It's, collecting. it's finding. It's acquiring. It's, but you're not it's really organizing. Doing it's storing. You're collecting. It's I, nothing treasuring. It, but you're not doing anything. You're collecting. Things. I just listed a bunch of verbs. But you're not. Doing, and I'm offended. Doing anything. I am so offended. I'm right just now. trying to offend collectors because I like to find new groups to get mad at me. That's one of that's one of the things the cheap host does. I think mods and collectors are there's no crossover. Oh, you can't be the same. They're, yeah, you know, because yeah, yeah, yeah. collectors they like to keep things how they are. It's like in mint condition. Modders <laughs> like to destroy and change things. Yeah, and then there are people like me who do neither. Yeah, cheap hosts. Uh, we just talk trash about both groups. How many people? I know I am a collector, and I don't talk trash about us. Um. I collect food in my mouth. Yeah, you do. That's right, Rhett, you're a collector. <laughs> <laughs> you're a human trash compactor, basically. And that's not really doing anything, that's eating, see? To prove my point. What How many people it, just give me the number, because I want to see a long Furby. Uh, 3,500. 26,000. Well, okay. A lot more than the fingernails. Just found out about this subreddit. Here's Edward on a slide. Okay, so they put a big tail on Edward. Okay. You're Edward on a slide. I get it. Do you have any others to show me? Because is this, this is, they're all modded in the same way? Please don't join this. I'm not gonna join this. Long, I accidentally typed Ling Furbies. Wonder what that is. Long Furbies. Um, oh. Long Furbies are, oh, good gracious. That's a, that's not just a long Furby. It it's just modified Furbies. Many of them are long. Some yeah, some like that one is a duck that has a Furby on top of it to make the duck neck. Oh crochet. They really 
they get a lot. They get away with anything on this thread. There's the mods are weak. I kind of respect this group more now that I'm seeing it. The mods are super. To be quite weak. honest with you, Blink, I have another one for you. Subreddit Toaster writes. This is a subreddit dedicated to discussing toasters in a normal way. <laughs> in a. <laughs> In a normal way. As opposed to an abnormal way. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure that they're talking about them in a normal way. Oh, this is so strange. 324 people. More. 3,240 people. More. 32,400 people. Less. 30, 20,000. Less. 10,000. More. 15,000. Less. 13,000. Exactly, correct. <laughs> Which one, classic or unique design? So people are just answering that question? So that's the, I don't see the unique design. You can't, can you scroll right? Uh, I'm looking at a couple of You give me half here. the post. What, what have you got? It's anything. I'm still looking at long Furbies over here. It's anything toaster related. Um, it just says, we share ideas on how to improve our society and make it a better place for toasters. <laughs> Pictures of toasters are highly encouraged. I think I might have to follow Long Furby. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm just wanna, back on it. I don't wanna be dreaming about Long Furbies, man. <laughs> These folks in toaster rights are collecting toasters from 1914. Got this. Thermax E thirty nine forty six from nineteen fourteen today. First person says whopping forty five amps. I want you to look. I just want you to look. I just want you to look. Can you ask me another one? I can rent. Uh, well, what a quinky dink. <laughs> Toasters G W. Toasters Gone Wild, a subreddit dedicated to showing and talking about toasters in a sexual or highly affectionate uh -oh, way. Oh, now I understand. So, okay, yeah. It would have made sense if yeah. you went first. Yeah, it actually around. made it funnier to do it this yeah, way. Yeah, it did, good work, good work team. Um, um, how many people, so how many people were in that one? 13,000. Uh, 13, 13, 13, 13, so are there more in Toasters Gone Wild? Oh, I hope so. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it has slots. Two, often, sometimes four. Sometimes four. You got four things to stick in the toaster? Yeah, man. Index, middle, ring, and pinky. I bet you couldn't fit four fingers in a toaster at the same time. Do you know how far apart the slots are? Uh, you know what? I don't really, I'm not taking that dare. How, how wide can you get your fingers? I don't think I could, pretty, pretty I, I don't wide. think I could get that in a toaster. Oh, I can get that. I think I had to double up. How many, how many members, Rhett? How many members? Toaster's gone wild. Uh, actually, I think there's less. 7,000. Mm, even less. 4,000. 6,000. Six, right. Let's see one. Not a bad guess. Not a bad guess at all. Whoa, this one likes to play games. <laughs> so it's got, <laughs> it has a, a, a graphics, Card. It, it has it's a, a computer. It has a computer fan attached to the side of it, and it has the LEDs. Cool. That's a sexy toaster. Pretty sexy. You know? I don't like it though. Okay. I'm not into it. This is an acronym: S E U T. First of all, can you just guess what that means? Some Unix untie. That's them, it. Th themselves. That's it. And then they're no longer Unix. It's actually squirrels eating unconventional things. Ooh. This. Ooh, this I, is I, nice. This I, is this is a this is a cool million. I saw a TikTok recently related to this, and it was a utility worker in the city of Philadelphia, I believe, mm -hmm. and he was at a light pole in the city, and there was a little cover on the bottom of. And he goes up to it and he takes the cover off of it. And nuts start falling out of it. And nuts just pour out of it. Like, <laughs> like the whole pole. Thousand, the whole pole has been filled with nuts. 
<laughs> some squirrel was filling that pole up with nuts, and then they just did a TikTok and got rid of them all. And I felt so bad for that squirrel. Oh, they think about all the work that he did. And he's just sitting there somewhere watching. So, oh, no, 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 no. Shaking that tail, you know, like, you know, just like, don't do that, <laughs> you know? Yeah. Guys, come over here. Someone is dumping out all my pole nuts. But that would be a conventional thing. So what is an unconventional thing? Maybe that they could eat. Let's just and that's gonna be it. I'm just gonna tell you right now. We cannot keep going with this. <laughs> Download the Mythical Society app to play our free daily GMM trivia game, Think It, It's Sink It, today.